All right, guys, so this video is really to show you, you know, how do you uh, learn something once and not have to keep relearning? Because the purpose of this video is to say, how do I, how do we reinforce and not have to relearn? Because, you know, the biggest part of going through this whole step one uh, process is there's so much information, so much material. And by the time you kind of, <clears throat> you know, circle through all this stuff, you, you know, and come back around to the beginning, you're like, well, well, oh my gosh, you know, I, I forgot everything that I that I learned in the very, you know, in the very front end. So then yet it's just a complete recycle of like, oh my gosh, I got to relearn this because I forgot. So this is what I would do, especially when it comes to biostats. It means math. So uh, you, you still have to learn this once. And then once you have that concept down, then it's just a matter of reinforcing it. And so this is, this is essentially what I did. Um, if you look at some of those videos, the especially the the review videos, and there's there's one that I actually did, you know, the the very 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 original, uh, you know, you could easily go to the, to the end of each question and then kind of screenshot it. But on one of the review videos, one of the newer ones, I actually in, intentionally uh, <clears throat> just had every problem worked out first, and then we just kind of went through it. So really, what I'm saying is, if you just screenshot of these things, okay, and you got to think about this, there's I, and I forget how many sections there are, eight, nine sections or something, something to that effect. And probably you'd probably get two, three questions of biostats on each one. So, we're, you know, we're looking at 20, 30 questions, <clears throat> you know, plus minus uh, in, on the whole exam. So they're going to hit the big stuff, right? They're, and if you look through the comments, um, if you look through the comments on the, on the biostats videos, the people who, after they took the test, came back and said, look, you, that stuff was on there. You know, thank, thank you for the videos and all that stuff. And um, it makes me feel good because we're still right over the target when it comes to making sure that we learn this stuff. But the, the long story short is this, it's the basics or what's, or is, is what's going to get you through the exam. So what I would do is go to one of those review uh, videos and then, you know, just print out every question. Now, it, this only takes a few minutes. You know, you just go to each one, get to the final screen where you where my hands are out of the way. And then, <clears throat> you know, you should just be able to look at this. You know, once you learn it, I'd say if you took, you know, it's less than, we're talking 10 seconds a sheet where you're just going through these and like, okay, and, you, and you're just processing it. You're saying, okay, this type of question, I'm going to do this. And you mentally rehearse that. And then you can go through an entire 20, 30 <clears throat> however many questions you want to print that I've done, uh, you know, stick with the review videos first because that, that's your, your meat and potatoes as far as what's going to probably be on your exam. <clears throat> and then all those other little single videos, those are kind of questions people may have sent in to me that I kind of re, you know, adjusted a little bit, uh, but it's stuff that you might see as well. But if you just stick with the basics, print this out, and then go ahead and uh, just kind of review this over and over. It should take you, again, 10 seconds per sheet. And therefore, you can go through all the questions in biostats and then never have to relearn this again. Because what's going to happen if you what's going to happen if you learn this and then you set it down? You know, don't touch it for a month. You're going to you're gonna have to go back and say, oh, my God, is, is, it, is, it, is it this? Is the sensitivity this way? Um, and there's nothing worse than having to relearn something, especially when you're going through this process. So that's my tip. Now, can you do that through every every topic? I mean, you, you can to some extent, uh, and that's why, <clears throat> you know, when I made those those laminated sheets, you know, that was my study guide to kind of just mentally uh, go through things in an organized fashion. And you know, that's why I I'm so consistent. Even when I made like making this video, I was like, well, let me go back to the office and and I'll do it here. If I do it anywhere else, it'll be a distraction. And it's mainly just to have that mindset of you know, just be consistent. Uh, you know, just just rehearse things. When I did the uh, when I did that audio for the biochemistry, uh, you know, it was just to start from the beginning, start from the beginning, and work your way down. And I think you, if you do every topic like that, um, it's going to build confidence. And, and and confidence walking into that exam is is that's half the battle. Uh, it, it it really is. I mean, you got to have the knowledge, but you better have that expectation of okay, I got this. You know, I got this. So that's my tip, guys. Uh, go to the biostats. Go to one of the review videos. Just print out sheets, you know, 30, 40, whatever questions they, <clears throat> there are. Make sure you understand them. You know, that's what the videos are for. Slow it down um, if you need to learn it. And then after that, you should never have to relearn biostats again. And I'm telling you, this will help. This will this will get you through step one, step two, and step three, and whatever biostats they may have on your um, you know, board certification test as well. So that's my tip, guys. Hope it's helpful.